so basically, what happened was we had a unit that a lady lived in there for 18 years yeah. in the same apartment, and she was a hoarder. And ah, they're still the worst. We found 18 rats. Um, the bigger dead. Both <laughs> in the wall outside. Uh, roach infested. When I tell you roach infested, I mean mounds of roaches. Yeah. Um, everywhere, live, dead, all over. I mean, just never seen anything like it. The yeah. smell was so bad. You walk in three seconds later, you just had to walk out. The movers were dry even outside. They were like, couldn't even. It was that bad. Um, make a long story short, did gutted the whole place out. She moved out, gutted the whole place out. Tearing the wall, the drywall, I mean, everything. Had to. Really. Had to. Yeah. There was no getting around it. Yeah. Um, that's when we found the dead rats in the wall. Well, anyways, to make a long story short, put the drywall back up, ripped up, seal, sealed the concrete, put new drywall up, cleaned air ducts, might clean the air ducts, um, everything you could imagine. And every time I walked in, we're like, man, the smell, it just still stinks in here. Like, I tried everything. And I said, Mike, Get your ozone machine over here. That's right. He blasted it with like, I don't know if you put two or three of these. Yeah. And it's gone. Gone. Not only was it gone, I had pest control in there three times, four times. Yeah. You know, helped, but these things were, I mean, we're talking, lady had her bed in the living room. When she moved the bed, there was a mound that was probably two foot high of just dead roaches. Okay, I mean, it was disgusting. Yeah. So, that being said, you still every once in a while had, so after I put the ozone machine in there, there wasn't a roach to be found anywhere. You know what's interesting about roaches, so I developed the country's first and only patented uh, bed bug system that revolves around ozone, even bigger machines than these. And, but roaches, they find their way with scent trails. So they lay down a scent trail and that's how the colony finds its way. And ozone actually will oxidize and destroy the scent chemicals that they use. Oh. So a lot of people don't realize this. So when you run an ozone treatment, roaches can't stand it because it's like making them blind or like cutting a dog's nose off. You know, they lose their capacity to sense their direction. And so they'll just find a better place to be if you don't kill them outright with the gas. So right. it's kind of cool. No, and, and so it was kind of like by accident yeah. type of thing. And I said to Mike, Mike said he had found some <laughs> dead roaches in his machine. Nothing crazy. Yeah. Um, and so I passed along to other property managers. And other, and uh, we just recently, about a month or two ago, I had one call me up and said, man, we tried everything. We got roaches. I said, man, call Mike and tell him to put his ozone machine in there. I said, I don't want to guarantee you anything, but I can tell you that he's not doing pest control; he's doing odor removal. But at the end, those roaches sure don't come yeah. back. And uh, it worked. Yeah. It worked. So now my little so-called—I don't know—it's my trick. But yeah. a lot of these uh, supervisors and different uh, other my other guys don't know is use ozone machine. Now they don't know about Mike's ozone machine until I introduce Mike. And, sure. and the other thing that um, nobody has what he has that I found yet. Yeah. yeah. Here or Fort Myers, Naples, uh, Boca, Fort Lauderdale, Miami. It's a lot. Do I know them all? Of course, there's tons of. So you probably made it. Well, there's a lot of competitors out there, but most of them really, to find a machine that makes a similar output, you're going to spend twenty eight hundred dollars, and they break. Now I know that there's a, there's certain carpet companies that are. I don't know if they have to have a special license or they just have to have the money. There's the the big ones, the big monster ozone machines. Yeah. Like I want to call them. Yeah. Not the little ones. Yeah. That's what I like about these. They're very small and easy to big punch. Now the big ones, they're hard to find, but there were carpet companies that did carry them that get a bigger amount of space or stronger. I don't yeah. know the terminology, yeah. but yeah. Um, so they are those you can find. Yeah, those are like the Dell ozone. They're like but these are great because machines. Mike can leave them in there. The guys can pick them up and put them in their maintenance shop when they're done. Mike can pick them up the next day. That's awesome. Um, and I, I've been trying to get So my, you're a satisfied, I'm you manage many properties, not, not just a few properties, oh, no. we're talking many, many properties, many. all over Boca Raton mm -hmm. and South Florida. Mm -hmm. And you, Mike's your go-to guy when it comes to odors. Oh yeah, the, uh, let me, he has not put this in a unit that I have not been able to get rid of an odor. Whether That's, it be curry, whether it be 
dead rat box. Dead rock. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you name it, it's yeah. it's worked. And you, uh, you gotta have had a few. I'm so amazed by it. I've been using it. I'm like, I, I call them up one day and said, "Man, that thing is amazing." It just. So you probably have had a few dead bodies, I'd imagine, over your um, years. Um, three. Three. And at that time, I didn't know Mike. Really? Yeah. yeah well, so now you gotta care <laughs> next time. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to run into any more. <laughs> Uh, but like well, I said, it is Florida. There are a few, uh, you know. It's a great product. People, it works good. It's um, I can't say enough about it. Like well, I said, hey man, I really appreciate you taking time to pop in while we were checking out this yeah project to Mike's and, and I want I want to get him. I want to get Mike. You know, I know what type of work he does. I'm all about customer service. That's what made me link on to Mike. Normally, I get a lot of vendors coming in and they do their sales pitch or whatever. I'm like, yeah, yeah. But the follow through's not there. I just something made him click, and I liked his presentation. He's got he uses the best product, you know, chemicals, machine, everything else. And then when he's with the ozone machine, I tell you, you got to see it to believe it. Everybody can come and say mine's the best. Mike is close to he's right up there the most amount of ozone machines of any one odor removal guy that I have. Forty, he's got forty machines. It's a lot of machines, and he keeps them working, which is yeah. even better. It yeah. means he's making money. But you can make money too. That's it. So my thing is, like I said, if I can get him in and people are like, man, I can't get the smell out. If I can get him in there and they'd see, like, it's gone. Because, you know, sometimes odors are just really hard to get rid of. That's right. They got to see for themselves, like, I'm telling you, this will get rid of the smell. That's right. I sent Mike over to a unit. The kid's like, man, remember Mike? He said, I can't get, I can't get rid of it. I can't get rid of it. I said, call this number. Talk to Mike. Get him over there. It's gone. Well, you know, it isn't just the machine. There is skill involved with this business. There's a learning curve. And Mike, because he's so smart and he's so dedicated to what he does, has figured out all the tips and all the tricks and everything that it takes. And he's going to get it out no matter what. Yeah. Beautiful. Thanks so much for your hey, time. I greatly appreciate it. No problem. Yeah, man.